All right, MLB The Show, one time. Give me Trout, one time. One time. There's a bat. Please. Please. Freddie Freeman, every year. Every year, Freddie Freeman. I mean, I'll take it. It's a diamond, but... I want a trout. Welcome to the show, Freddie. What's going on YouTube? Run Good Life coming at you with a brand new video today. And again, we have a voiceover video today in the process of setting up the new Logitech Brio webcam, which you see on my face, not looking so red. Uh, I messed up the microphone settings again. We are doing 2021 Bowman Megas. We're also gonna do a cello pack giveaway. So stay tuned, I will explain how you can enter to win those um but yeah my first look at 2021 bowman on the channel these are going to be the mega boxes which have the two exclusive five card mojo packs i'm going to be battling my patreon member today uh rick so i'm going to be on the right he is going to be on the left uh nothing up for grabs uh now if you want to be a member of my patreon as well and get featured in a video like this you can do so over at patreon.com slash run good life three different tiers you can also get in to the basic tier which is going to give you two extra video series a month i would gladly appreciate your support uh without further ado though we are going to check these out uh the thing about the mega boxes last year what i can remember is that the base packs only have chrome and paper you do not have a chance at autographs or numbered cards those are going to come in the mojo packs I've lost my mojo! But there is a lot of value to these, especially hitting some of those low-numbered uh, low numbered uh, mojo cards or autographs. Now, if you want a chance to win, and I'll, as, I'm, as I'm doing this as a voiceover, I was looking, you can actually see the front card on the Bowman Fat Pack. Uh, it was very surprising to me. If you want a chance to win one of these two Bowman Fat Packs, gotta be subscribed to the channel, so be sure to hit that subscribe button. Then let us know in the comment section who your favorite current active player to watch is. Um, just two two simple things. We'll pick two winners in a few days and uh, give away some Bowman cello packs. So maybe you have a chance to hit a big rookie first Bowman Chrome auto or something like that. Again, we're going to get into it today. 2021 Bowman. These are $29.99 each at retail. That is what I paid. I found these on a Friday afternoon at a local Fred Meyer. I uh, walked in. They were the last two sitting on the shelf, so I was very, very happy about that. Rick recently signed up for the Patreon channel or Patreon page. He said, I'm a, fa I'm a baseball fan. I said, perfect. I already know what we're going to do this month. So me and Rick are going to battle it out to see who has the better a mega box here. Um, yeah, I like to do a little Bowman. Now, I will say in years past, uh, I was hyper into Bowman, hyper into minor league, uh, following all the minor leagues. Uh, as life gets, you know, as you get older and life gets a little more uh, hectic, you, you have to pick and choose your battle. So I don't get to follow too much minor league these days. I'm not really in tune with the prospecting game outside of maybe the top 10 prospects and i'm always a little bit late to the show so i'm always learning uh the bowman sets kind of as uh as the weeks roll on afterwards i'm not you know in the past i used to know who's going to be on the auto checklist who the big rookies are nowadays not so much it's always after the fact unless there's a very hyped prospect like last year with bobby witt jr and jason dominguez years past you know we had like wander franco and whatnot uh, so, like I said, Rick is going to be on the left, and I am going to be on the right. We are going to save those five-card mojo packs for last. And um, you all know that I'm pretty, pretty bad with these battles. I typically take the L more often than not. Uh, so let's get underway. Kicking things off, I really like the design of Bowman this year. A little bit of futuristic design. Always has beautiful white borders. Have some base cards up front. These base vets are not going to be worth too much. Uh, the allure of Bowman is really going to be those first Bowman chromes. And we have a good one right here to kick off. A Kevin Alcantara uh, value on this. Currently at about 8 to 9 bucks on eBay raw. Um, going to be a while before we see these graded with uh, PSA still shut down. 
Kevin Alcantara, one of the top prospects to go along with the kid from Toronto, Austin Martin, I believe. I hope I'm right there. I hope I'm not sounding stupid. Uh, back of the pack, we are going to have some paper Bowmans. Again, paper Bowmans are not going to have too much value. Um, you know, if the player turns into a superstar, maybe like a Juan Soto or Fernando Tatis. But otherwise, with how much Bowman is printed, it's just going to be uh, not too much value other than the Chromes. Joey Bart, rookie right there for San Francisco. Nate Pearson. Xander Bogertz, who I think is underrated. Our Chromes in the pack going to be Brennan Davis. And... You smell Diaz. So again, not a first chrome right there. The first chromes are, you can tell the first chromes, they do have the first chrome stamp on them. So each Bowman Mega, we are going to get four 10 card packs and two five card mojo packs. Uh, we have Goldie, Josh Bell, Mookie Betts, Alex Bregman, Jose Abreu, Tristan Casas. Not going to be a first. Good right name right there, though, for Boston. Carson Tucker, going to be for the Cleveland Indians. Uh, and then just some more paper on the back. So, yep, one more pack to go in my Mega. Again, nothing really on the line. Uh, but, you know, hey, in the interest of making it making it a little bit more interesting, me and Rick are going to battle it out. Ryan Mountcastle, rookie right there. Christian Javier. Braylon Marquise, you do get a lot of rookie cards. But, again, paper rookies and Bowman. Not going to be anywhere near as value as paper rookies in the Topps flagship set. Uh, ending my base packs with Xavier Edwards. All right, time to check out these mojo packs. We get two in each box. You can typically tell one of them is usually thicker. The thicker ones do notate there's going to be an autograph or a numbered card. They print those on a little bit thicker card stock, so you can actually see on the side if you have anything other than a base you can kind of feel it sometimes as well kicking off with bryson stott absolutely beautiful mojo refractors i love the look of these every year um been been ripping mega boxes of bowman for a while there is a pc card from a julio rodriguez i will absolutely take that great card right there not his first he's been tearing it up for the everett aqua Swox. four home runs and four straight games and uh, 10 hits so far. Very short season. High A Everett Aqua Sox. Going to be one of the best minor league teams ever. Just an amazing wealth of talent for the Mariners. Ending the first mojo pack with Ed Howard. Uh, that is a team that also has Emerson, Hancock, and George Kirby. All of the Mariners prospects really stashed down there. Of course, we have Logan Gilbert and Julio or Jared Kelenic, who are now called up on the team. Uh, kicking off our second mojo pack, it looks like we do have a green underneath this Drew Waters. So we will go ahead and hold that for a second. Futurists Emerson Hancock just said that. He was in Bowman last year. Um, so I will definitely take that. Another PC card. Alex Thomas and Adley Rushman. Rushman now, I believe that's either his third or fourth year Bowman. Hopefully we'll see him in the show soon. Check this green Looking like a pitcher. Oh, I like that. I like that hat. And it's going to be Logan Gilbert, who just recently made his debut for the Mariners. Gilbert's 0-2. Boy, check swing. He goes around. And the first strikeout in the big league career of Logan Gilbert is in the books. That is going to be a green mojo, numbered 99. So we will absolutely take that for the PC. I'm stealing Shy City stuff. Yeah, yeah, Shy. I'm going to steal your gimmick. I don't care anymore. Uh, so I will definitely take that card. And that was a great mega for me. Uh, not a ton of value there. The Alcantara going to be the best card in the box. I will take the Logan Gilbert to 99 for the PC. Also an Emerson Hancock. That is actually my first Emerson Hancock. I did not get any of his first chromes. And Julio Rodriguez, who uh, has been, like I said, tearing it up at the minor league level. All right, let's kick off Rick's mega box now. Should be an easy win for him. He just has to beat my one Bowman chrome. Got some paper prospects up front. Great looking design. His chromes in his first pack are going to be Francisco Alvarez and a, trying to read that upside down, uh, Paguara. So I think I'm still in the lead at this point. We have Brandon Marsh, Reyes, and Ramirez to end his first pack. I do like these Bowman Megas. $50 per, or sorry, 50 cards per box, $30. You get a nice chance at, you know, some of the top name first Bowman chromes. And then those two mojo packs, really the allure. You also get a ton of rookie cards, but like I said, not a whole lot of value. Unless you're just looking to add them to your personal collection, then it's great. Like this pack, for example, 
Joe, Joe Adele and Cabrian Hayes, a great pack to go along with Spencer Howard. First Chromes are going to be Jordan Walker and Jackson Kowar. Ending the pack, we have Robinson, Libator, and Royce Lewis, who I feel like Royce Lewis has been in Bowman for like four years right now. He may have even had a Bowman card in like 2016. Uh, I could be wrong, but I feel like I've seen his name in Bowman forever at this point. Josh Donaldson, Aaron Nola, Joey Gallo, Vladdy Jr. having a good year. Luis Robert, who is on the shelf right now. We have Austin Wells, not a first Bowman Chrome, and... We also have a Trent DeVoe that is going to be a first Bowman Chrome outfielder for the Angels. I think they have a pretty good one in the outfield already. Marco Luciano, maybe an all-timer. I don't know. Angels, uh, rival of my Mariners. So, been watching Trout kill us for the last, uh, pretty much the last decade. 2-2. Two -two. This one's out towards center field. Towering shot, chasing Trout back. That ball's hit pretty good. And at the wall, Trout leaps up, and he got it! Freddie Freeman, Tanner Hook, uh, Sam Huff, Dalton Varsho, Brady Singer. Chromes are going to be Helio Ramos and looks like uh, Ivan Johnson, first Bowman right there. Ending the regular packs for Rick, we have Brennan Davis, Logan Davidson, and Gabriel Urias. All right, now we get into where it's really at with Bowman. Uh, especially for the Mega Boxes, these are going to be the Chrome exclusive mojos. I think my Mega's still in the lead. Let's see if uh, let's see if Rick can 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 notch one in the win column. I don't win too many of these battles. We have Montero, Tristan Casas, Rookie of the Year favorites, Evan White. Batting average not great, but man, we love Evan White here. And uh, we have Nick Lodolo and Christian Robinson to end the pack. All right, we are down to one pack left for Rick. Come on, Rick. You got to beat me. Everybody beats me when it comes to these battles. I do not win very many. George Kirby right there, another Mariner. A lot of Mariners in this video. We have Max Meyer, Josh Jung, Futurists. That's going to be Austin Hendrick. Love. That's a good-looking insert. Full bleed. Francisco Alvarez and George Kirby going to end the mega for Rick. So I do think that I am taking the win in this battle. Again, a friendly battle. Um, but you know what? Rick is a new Patreon member. I can do what I want. So I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to give Rick all of the cards in this video with the exception of the three Mariners I pulled. You're also going to get that Kelvin Alcantara. That's about an 8 to $10 card. I'm going to go ahead and keep the three on the right. He is going to get all of those cards just a perk for being one of my Patreon members. Uh, but again, we are doing a cello pack giveaway. If you've not already done so, I would appreciate it if you could hit subscribe on my channel. And then go ahead and drop a comment. Let me know who your favorite current player is, your most exciting. Who do you like to watch? I'll go out and pick a couple of winners here, probably in a few days or so. But that is going to do it for me today. I uh, would much appreciate it if you hit that subscribe button. You can also join the Patreon if you want over at patreon.com slash rungoodlife. And uh, depending on what tier you choose, you can have one of these videos on my YouTube channel customized for yourself. But that is going to do it for me today. Take care, stay safe, and as always, I will catch you next time on Down the Road.